After days of waiting, more than a thousand migrants decided to advance to the international bridge that divides Guatemala and Mexico. The closure of this border has prevented them from advancing. They come from several countries. We are not here representing a border or a country. We're here representing all of Central America. Although Central Americans share many reasons for migrating, some, like Nelly, are not seeking economic improvement. She wants to find her son, who is missing in Mexico. It's difficult knowing he could be alive or dead. Only God knows, so that's my goal. I have soul and feet, but I need to know if he's dead or alive. Although Guatemala is part of the Central American Agreement on Free Movement, which allows citizens of Honduras, El Salvador, Nicaragua and Guatemala to travel freely, the Guatemalan police resorted to force, firing tear gas to stop the migrants. Among those affected by the repression were a number of families with children. I fled from Honduras where they also treat us badly. We want to escape from violence and here there is more violence. We just want a free country for our kids. Before them, an unwanted reality, the Mexican border remains closed. Despite the police violence, the Central American migrants are not giving up on their attempt to travel north. Pablo Perez Garcia, Telesur.